Hello and welcome to the Own the Life of Your Dreams YouTube channel. My name is Tamisha. I'm so glad to have you here with me today. And today I'm going to talk to you about something serious as far as what is going on with your business and how you can make your dreams or your goals a reality. And the first step, of course, we talked about before is setting aside time to sit down and create your goals. Write them out. Be specific. Tell what it is specifically that you want and also write the time frame in which you want to get it done. Set a date. So if your date is by the end of the year, then by December 31st, whatever year it is that you're watching this, then that is what you put. If it is by the end of the month, then put that. But be specific, be specific on your goal, and also be specific on what it on the time frame in which you want to get it done. The second thing is to create a desire and to make it your desire an obsession. And generally what happens with our goals is we see them. And if they're really good goals, they're goals that stretch us, right? They're goals that are not necessarily goals that we think that we can accomplish of our own free will or of our own doing because we don't think we have what we need to have to get them done. We don't have enough money. We don't have enough skills. We don't have the right people in our corner and so on and so on and so forth and all the excuses and when I was in college we all had a little saying in my um, fraternity for women was you know excuses are tools of incompetence that build monuments of nothingness and those who dwell on them seldom amount to anything. It's better to be thought a fool than to open one's mouth and remove all doubt. I'm so surprised that I remember that. But anyway, it is true. Excuses kind of build up this whole top thing in your mind that keeps you from doing what you need to do. And basically the excuses aren't you. It's basically your repressed self or how should I say it is the negative energy that's flowing around you that's making you think that you can't. But in order to do extraordinary things, you have to push boundaries and limits to get them done. And fear is going to come. Doubt is going to come. But at those times, it's better, better to remember the goal. Remember what it is that you're seeking for, searching for, and build it up so strongly in you, you create a desire. And the way you create a desire is by seeing yourself physically doing what it is you want to do. Building a middle, mental picture in your mind that says, I am going to be a millionaire, all right? I am going to lose 50 pounds. I am going to be a better mother to my kids, a better father to my kids, to be a better spouse. Whatever goal that you set, you can achieve it as long as you create a mental picture, keep it burned in your mind, and any time that doubt comes to you, you recall the picture. You keep your goal card with you, you read your goals, and as soon as you're finished with their goals, you create the picture. And you do that again and again until that doubt fades. Remember, limits are something that you impose on yourself. You can do anything that you choose to. With the right guidance, the right education, and the right mental picture, you can do whatever it is that you want to do. And the other two are generally not as necessarily important as the picture. Because once you have the picture and the goal, things will start happening in your life to bring everything else that you need to accomplish and bring that goal into fruition. All right, so create the picture. Let it be part of you. Let this burning desire in you out. And as you create and build this desire, it will then start to become an obsession in your life. You won't be able to think of anything else, do anything else, function any other way until you create this goal that you have put before you and you and the things around you will start to mold itself into that form and then eventually you'll have what you set out to have. Alright, so I hope this video was of value to you. It was real short. I just wanted to jump on here and give you some mindset encouragement to help you push through 
the, the stopping points that we get in our life, the doubts, the fears that we face, because it's not you that's doing it. You can do whatever you want to do, all right? It is the negative energy, the past mistakes, the things, the planning, the not the planning, the conditioning. It is our conditioning that has made us the way that we are. And so in order to stop your conditioning, you have to create a new habit because all conditioning is is our habits. And so to stop a habit, you create a new and better one. And eventually there'll be no room for the old one. All right. So hopefully this was of value to you. If it was, make sure you give me the thumbs up, like the video and subscribe to the channel. I'm giving you fresh daily videos just like this to help you be successful online and offline in life and business. So if that's something that you want or are more interested in, make sure that you click that subscribe button so you can join me on this journey. Also, if you're interested in getting full-time income, making full-time income online, then click the first link in the description box. It gives you all the information you need and I will pair up with you to help you on your journey because we all need a little help sometimes. All right, so until next time, my friend, make sure you think big, dream big, take action so that you may own the life of your dreams. Bye now.